what's going on YouTube it's Kazam here I'm just making this video real quick after the RC because I wanted to give a big thank you to not only the leads the members everyone in obey but also the community um, the RC chat on Twitter everybody that supported me followed me subscribed commented on my videos tagged me in the tweets all that stuff was awesome I've been away from COD for several years now um, I played Vanguard Probably the first two months didn't like it played some of the stuff in between tried cold war for the first few months didn't really like it so i just played other games and you can see that uh throughout my upload history there was a couple years during covid that i came back and played but it was real casual i haven't grinded like i grinded this rc in a long time so it was really fun getting back into cod i actually like this game um i think it's better than a lot of the other new gen games to me because it's got a lot of the maps for my favorite COD. The reason I went inactive for this last week and uploaded my RC response a week early is because I had to move. While moving, I really hurt myself pretty bad and I was very sick. So I was gonna upload like a day or two ago, but I just wasn't feeling it. I was in bed, I couldn't move. And honestly, none of you really care. None of that really matters. Uh, if you do wanna know what happened, you could DM me. Now to get to the real point of the video, what you're seeing in the background is just leftover stuff. like. Clips from the RC that I didn't think were good enough to go in the montage or in the final response. I just decided to use them for this long form video to uh, start uploading again and talk a little bit about my RC experience. I thought it was fun. It was really great. Clash of Clans and stuff like this are the things that the community needs. And in my personal opinion, it's good. It's good to bring people together. It's good to interact with each other because if no one's doing this and no one's interacting with each other anymore, and it's all just like 2015 and prior years where let's just hate on each other and be assholes. Well, then it just dies and teams end and people quit and there's no audience for this anymore because nobody's doing it. So I think what I'm trying to say is at the same time as we're all creating content, videos, shorts, tweets, whatever, we are the audience and I don't want to take away from that audience. I want to add to it, right? We should be encouraging people to continue this hobby for as long as possible. Now for the real reason that I'm making this video, why do I want to join Obey? I know it's a day after the RC. Um, with all that being said, like I said earlier, I've been really busy, you know, sometimes life gets in the way. Uh, I feel like I did a pretty good job grinding out the edit and the clips for my montage response. I'm happy with it, but I do think it could have been better if I was able to use the entire time of the RC. That's okay though, I still had fun. I still was able to gain over 200 followers on Twitter. Um, I deleted both my old Twitters from the last time I quit. So this new one's fresh and it's cool to see how fast it grew. A couple of my goals for the RC that I wanted to accomplish was uploading every day, which that did not happen. It was an unrealistic goal because at the same time, of editing and recording for the final RC response for that montage. I just had to take entire days off to edit shorts, edit long form, edit the montage where I wasn't going for clips. And I feel like I probably should have spent more time playing, going for clips and just making one banger final montage than trying to put up a short every day or a video every day, etc. That's okay though. The, the things that I wanna improve mainly right now is my short form content. So during the RC, I uploaded 24 shorts some did really well i was actually surprised how well they did some did better than others some didn't do that well at all but i'm not a big numbers guy i'm just doing this because i love doing it and as you can see on the screen here i mean i saw quite a bit of growth quite a bit more uh stats all around between gaining those 200 twitter followers and also um like the youtube analytics those are pretty big numbers for me for my small channel so i'm happy with that um, I also put out 16 videos and I made a playlist if you want to see what I think are the better long form videos from the RC. I know that needs work. I know my long form and my content creation is not good because the last time I was this into COD or this serious about the hobby was like 2015. That was the last time I quit when I was really grinding, really taking this stuff serious. And since then a lot has changed and the standards for a good long form video are definitely totally different from back then. So I know my long form and my shorts need quite a bit of work. If you look at the first shorts versus the recent shorts, I think there's already been uh, quite a bit of an improvement just in the quality and the way I've been editing them. And that's something I want to continue to work on. You will see if you continue to follow the channel and interact with me. I'll be putting out long form, but this won't be like every day 
like I was trying to do during the RC. It's probably going to be once or twice a week for long form. If I can, I want to do a short every day and have like a dedicated upload scheduled day for daytage, weektage, montage, edit kind of thing, if that makes sense. On to the final reason of why do I want to join Obey. Um, this is actually the third time that I've done a recruitment challenge for Obey. That's most times that I've ever done an RC for any team. Uh, I think you can understand that this isn't just like a new thing. And with those two previous RCs, if you want to watch them, they're still up on my channel. Um, you'll probably have a good laugh. I don't think they're very good. Obviously, I didn't win, but that's okay. If you want to check those out, I'll play a couple clips from those videos, and you can find them on my channel if you want to watch them. So yeah, if you look at the dates on those, that was uh, several years ago, and a lot has changed for all of us. You know, we're all grown up now. We're all much more mature, and I like to think that we're all, I think we're all much better at the game as well, and doing this as a whole I think everyone's constantly improving and that's what we should aim for so yeah I mean it's always a team that I've looked up to it's always a team that I thought put out great montages and content throughout their entire history um, I love the old agony edits I love the infinite montage series the team Tages. I love all of it uh, it's a really dope team during the RC all the members all the leaders you guys are super cool super awesome Reacting to everybody's stuff on Twitter, interacting with us, talking to us in the RC chat, you know, it wasn't like some super hands off, alright, we're just gonna wait till the last day and watch everything, nah, you guys were killing it throughout the whole RC, supporting, watching, um, interacting with everybody that was going for it, and I think that's really awesome for the community, I love that you guys did that, I think everybody else did too, made it a really enjoyable experience. To be honest, without stuff like this going on, or Clash of the Clans, or different challenges and things to do, um, I think it does make the calm get boring. I think it does make people want to upload less when there's nothing like this going on. So overall, it was a really great move by you guys to, uh, to allow people to grow, interact with each other, gain not only friends, subscribers, followers, but just build good relationships, you know, do the things that make us want to keep playing the games, making these videos, going for clips, whatever it may be. So expect this to be probably the only long form video for the week. I'm still recovering from being sick and hurt and I still got a lot of boxes to unpack. This is like the first day I've really sat down with my setup and tried to get anything done COD related. Um, the new Clash of the Clans clan tag came out. Surf made it this round which is awesome. I'm super happy to be playing in Surf. I love everybody in Surf. These guys are killing it. We're gonna crush it this round. And if you guys want to see maybe like another week Taj, last last round I did a week Taj with uh, with the MX clan tag. I might try to do one this week. It depends how busy I am. At the very least, at the end of this COTC round, I'll be posting some type of montage with like the top 10, top 15, whatever best clips that I hit for the video. And be on the lookout. If you haven't seen it, go watch last round's response on the Surf Club channel. It's called Surf MX Response. If you haven't watched that yet, I need you to go watch it right now. And then after that, be on the lookout for the XH response coming soon when this round ends. That video is going to be a banger. I'm telling you, these guys are crushing it. We're grinding almost every day trying to take that W. So watch out, Revile. We're coming for you. All right, guys, that's all I've got for now. If you made it all the way to the end, thank you. I love you. Keep doing what you're doing. And if anybody needs anything at all, and you think that I can help, my DMs are always open on Twitter, link in the description. If you haven't seen my final Obey RC response, that'll also be linked in the description, as well as the playlist that I made for this year's Obey RC. So once again, thank you guys for watching, and have a great day.